Okay, so I gotta put some more of these magnetic baby locks on some of our cabinets. And I've already used two of them, and I, we really like them, but I wish they came with another key, but they don't. So I'm wondering if any magnet will work. So I've got all that stuff ready, and I've got the, the drill ready. Okay, is this not ridiculous? Look at this mess under here. I had it organized once. I think that was before we moved in and put anything in there, though. So what I've got to do is put this on the door and this somewhere here, and it latches. I did it to one of our closets, or our linen closet where we have our medicine, but... I need to do it here now. Look at that mess. Okay, so I just got back from Target and I was gonna go take my phone in with me and vlog because they had a bunch of stuff that was I think 70% off in the dollar spot. It was all picked over though, so you didn't really miss much. But um, my phone was dead. And the coolest thing, I came out and looked at my phone, it was charging while the car was off. I don't know how that, how that's possible in my own car and it, it didn't charge if the car was off so now that I know that I can charge it while I'm while I'm out in my car for lunch because I haven't been charging it because I thought that it wouldn't charge because I don't want to turn my car on there's no need to um let's see what I got the I got the locks so I have now three extra ones and what else did I get? Oh, I got a purse hook. That's the only thing I found in the nine or the seventy percent off stuff. And I'm going to Super H Mart and going to see what they have since I think it was Tanya who posted in the Texas Planner Addicts that she saw a bunch of cool stuff at the one in Carrollton. So I'm going to check out the one in Plano. Oh, my hair's falling out. So I'm going to check out the one in Plano. So okay, maybe I'll take my phone in with me there because I think it'll be charged enough for that. Okay, so there's not much in here that I want, but there is a store in here called Hello Pretty. It's got a bunch of different Hello Kitty and that kind of stuff in there. And there's like a little cosmetic store. And then some kind of fashion. It's like a little food court, actually, but this part has more little stores. But nothing that I'm really interested in. Okay, here's some of the stuff they have. They have, you know, a few little pins that are cute. Not as much as the as the Carrollton store, but still some cute things. And some Hello Kitty stuff. Look at that calculator, isn't that cute? And they got all these pins too. And then over here, <laughs> okay, so I thought I had such a good parking spot, but it seems that I went out the wrong door, so I have to walk a lot anyway. I wasn't too impressed. It wasn't the kind of stuff that I need. I think I have most all the cutesy stuff that I need for for filofaxing and stationary kind of stuff because I've been into that for so long and I don't use what I have so I need to stick with my lapins and, and the stuff that I use. <laughs> okay so back at my car. Uh, so I think I'm going to go did I say I needed to go? Oh, Michael's. I'm going to go to Michael's. And then I'm going to go back home and fix this lock. Okay, so all I'm going in here for is a basket to use as a toy box that I wanted last week. We'll see if that's all I get. Make sure no cars are coming. <laughs> I'm going into Michael's, by the way. It's hard to walk and talk at the same time, so I may not be able to vlog much this way. This is just something I'm trying. <laughs> Taking you along with me if I run into one of these people.
post, then we know that it's a bad idea. So we'll see how this goes. I have it behind my, <laughs> it looks, looks like I'm talking to my purse. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna turn it off so I can walk. I love all this stuff, this is so cute. A little bathtub. But none of this is stuff that me I need for a baby's room. But it's still cute. Oh, no, nah, those probably wouldn't be good to. I'm thinking of stuff to put in that little. Oh, that's cute. In that little wreath I made. Some picks or something. But I don't want something that a baby can eat. Oh, how about a little green bird? Oh, he's $5.99. That is too much. These are $2.99. Eh, I'll keep looking. <laughs> oh, I love this frame. Isn't that cute? Let's see what else I can find. You know, I wanted to get one of these last time I was here. There's the one I wanted. Maybe I'll get that. What else I was coming in here just to get a basket? Never works out that way, does it? Let me get some more of these flowers. The problem is, I don't remember which ones I already got. So I know I, well, that kind of tore up. Let's see, I don't want a broken one. I want that one. And I want the leopard one, if it's not going to break. The last one just broke. This holding the camera. I'm doing this is not too easy. Let's see, maybe a red and white one too. The red and white one's cute. Okay, so I was totally still filming and was walking at the same time. I like this one, but I want it bigger. The last time they had this bigger one, but I want this one. So they're 50% off and then I have a 25% off entire purchase coupon. Oh, I hope they still have the big one. If not, I'm going to go to another Michaels tomorrow. Oh, well, that one's kind of big. Let's see. Yeah, that's it, $19.99. We'll get that. So 50% off, and then it'd probably be about eight, seven fifty. It's not bad. It's a good basket to put toys in. I think so. Okay, I like this one too, but the only thing is I'm afraid that it would slam on the baby's fingers. See, I mean, it doesn't hurt my fingers, but it might hurt a baby's. So I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get this one without a, it doesn't have a top, but that's okay. Okay, so I ended up getting just the basket and the flowers to make the headbands and that little tin thing that I wanted. So I got out of there spending like $13 and some change. Not bad. So it wasn't a bad day spending wise, but I haven't made it home yet.